Let's talk about blood sugar regulation. This is a key concept to understand in the fat loss lifestyle. What I'm going to do is draw a blood sugar curve for you here. What you need to understand is that the body needs to keep blood sugar in a very narrow range because the brain feeds off of glucose and needs a constant supply of glucose. So all day long, your blood sugar levels will fluctuate. Your blood glucose levels will come up and come down, but they never get too low and they never get too high. The body doesn't like that. When you have a healthy metabolism, the body will keep it in this normal range. However, oftentimes, because of the things we choose to eat, like high sugar and high starchy foods, blood sugars can go very high. That leads the body to overcompensate by secreting a hormone called insulin. Insulin then drops blood sugar, oftentimes missing the mark and creating low blood sugar. Once your blood sugar goes low, the body then reacts by having increased cravings or increased hunger or energy lows. The body may also secrete cortisol that raises blood sugar back up. And oftentimes you can find yourself on this wild roller coaster ride of high blood sugar followed by low blood sugars, insulin release followed by cortisol release, all of which lead to insulin resistance, fat storage, and the inability to burn fat. The fix for this is two things primarily. One is to add in high fiber foods into the diet. High fiber foods that also don't have a lot of starch or sugar. This is primarily vegetables and fruits like berries, apples, pears, things like that. Because fiber keeps the blood sugar from going too high and then causes the body not to have to release so much insulin. Protein does the opposite. Protein keeps blood sugar stable because it's digested nice and slowly and doesn't let it drop too low, which keeps you from having excess cortisol production and compensatory hunger, cravings, and energy. So by making these two changes, focusing on vegetables and fruits and protein versus high starchy foods or high sugar foods will balance blood sugar, put you back into this range, and get you back into your fat burning zone. That is the difference between weight loss and fat loss. Paying attention to these hormonal reactions rather than just counting calories.